All right, so you dive back to about generally going to have two pouches, and then you may have some holsters on here as well. So we're going to show you how to put your diving back kit together, because if you're not buying it from a dealer, you're probably going to get it in a couple of pieces. And there are also some important things, even if you do get it put together, that you might need to know about adjusting it down the road. So how to put your pouches on, how to attach your holsters. Check it out. <laughs> back pouches are attached with our proprietary hook and loop system trifold hook and loop as diamondback damani would say so what does that mean that means that there is loop down here in your pouch or on your belt that keeps your pouch from sliding around then you've got this sandwich of hook and loop so it's not just you know stuck on there like it's gonna fall off Main thing you need to know, come from the top. Always work from the top. Bring your pouch down. Set that webbing right there with your loop. That's actually a hook. Fold it over. Then get back up in there. Get up in there now. Push that up under there. Bam, bam. Ain't going nowhere. When your winter time comes, you want to push it back a little bit, move it forward a little bit. You can do that within the realm of these two verticals. If you really want to move it, you can always unlace the belt by just going back through this buckle over here. Undo that, undo everything. You can unlace it. You can go around a couple of these because you've got one, two, three, four. If you want to go around that one or if you want to go around that one, it's not going to sag too much as long as you keep the tension tight with your belt on the pad with that buckle right there. Bam! Lovely. The hammer holster comes complete on the Elias for the um, Denali setup. Also on Denali, I've got the flat bar holster back here on my Wrangle pouch. Now, if you get this separate, it's going to come. It looks like this. It's got these two stainless steel bolts on it with a lock washer. Got a nylon insert in there and then this little strip. So, hey, how does that work? Here's my holster. Just take this hardware out. I'll thread this through over here and then with my adjustment strap I run it up through this buckle. Now the hammer holster comes in both a right side and a left side so make sure you've got the right one. When you have it here the taller side should be against your body so when you put the hammer in it hits against that and drops down. Uh, use an allen key to tighten these guys up. Your washer should be on the front and your bolt obviously on the front. The nut going back through and set your holster on there like that pretty simple i don't think i need to show you boys how to do that because y'all contractors y'all know how to do these kind of things bam